Welcome to this video on how to use the Show Confirm dialog in Java. This code is taken from code generated by Dr. Kate Finney and Dr. Don Cowell of the University of Greenwich. My name's Andy Wicks. Let me start off by looking at these import static statements. They're merely there to shorten the amount of code that appears on the screen. I wouldn't normally use those except that I'm creating this video and I want you to be able to see the code. This program outputs a confirm dialog box and to show you what that is I'm going to run the program. A confirm dialog box asks the user a question or a statement in this case and then gives three options yes, no and cancel. If the user presses yes, the value output is 0. If the user presses no, the value output is 1. And if the user presses cancel, the output is 2. So let me go through that in the code itself. We're asking the user to press the yes button. If they do that, that generates an integer. And we're going to call this integer yes value. We're then going to output the value returned was and whatever number is in yes value. This is the first one so the number returned is 0. Now we go on to the next block of code. The show confirm dialog asks the user to press the no button. This is put into an integer in this case called no value and that is then output in the line below. So this is the second one. So no generates one. And finally the sh final show confirm dialog asks the user to press the cancel button. That goes into an integer called cancel value. Cancel value is then output and the value of the cancel button is 2. So we now have a way of checking which button the user clicked. So let me show you that in action. Here is another program, Confirm Age. It asks the user whether they are over 21. And it puts the button number that they pressed into a variable, an integer variable, called age. So remember, if they press yes, it's 0, if they press no, it's 1, and if they press cancel, it's 2. So we can say if age is the same as 0, equal equals means the same as. Equals, just one equal sign, means make this variable have this inside it. So the user pressing a button will force age to accept a number 0, 1 or 2. Here we're checking whether age is the same as 0. If age is 0, then a message dialog will get output hello wrinkly. If it's 1 or 2, the message dialog will be too young to know anything. So Let's see this program running. Are you over 21? Well, for those who know me, the answer is yes. Hello, Wrinkly. But supposing I were to lie. No, I'm not over 21. I merely look it. Too young to know anything. I like that. Or supposing I want to refuse to answer and press the cancel button. It still tells me I'm too young to know anything. So that's how you use a show confirm dialog in a Java program. 